Yo, 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 what's going on, guys? This is your boy Street Rod 1929 back in the house with a game of Team Deathmatch on Jungle. Oh well, folks, you picked the wrong one. Uh, this is combat training. Don't be hating. Um, you can definitely tell this is combat training because uh, if you notice here, I got a gold FAMAS. And um, I actually don't have any gold guns in, uh, in uh, regular multiplayer because um, I just don't have the patience to prestige that many times. Although I think the gold gun looks very, very cool. Um, so anyway, um, I'm going to talk about this game as if this was really multiplayer. Um, normally, the spawns were over here. Um, you wouldn't find a guy just standing out, out there in the open, but you will find them coming up from this point. So this is actually where I do go. And they spawn um, right back over here to the left. Um, there's nobody here, so apparently the computer has flipped sides on the spawn. Um, and here's another guy just standing right out there. Um, so you, you wouldn't find that on, uh, on the multiplayer. Um, but you will in combat training. What's really nice about combat training, if you guys are not all that great in the multiplayer, this is your opportunity, and uh, this is my opportunity now, too, to be a C-Manners. Um, and what I mean by that is to just rock an unbelievable game, a flawless game I'm running here, and it is superior, but, you know, to try to get the scores that I get on these combat training, it's just not happening in multiplayer because people are just way smarter than the computer. But um, one thing I did find about the computer that's kind of interesting is um, you really can't hide um, because the computer knows where you are, even if you're running with Ghost. Um, so don't bother putting Ghost on, on the combat training. Um, you know, pick something else. But yeah, so I'm running with the FAMAS here. I haven't used this gun in a while. I figured, you know, let me just try something different with this combat training. Just have some fun, you know. And it looks very cool with the gold camo. And you can get, basically, um, with the PSN being down, um, you can load up combat training without going online. Uh, when you do combat training online, uh, what's going on there is you got to level up. So um, if you do it um, the way I'm doing it without being online, because obviously the PSN is down unless you're on the Xbox, um, you get all the guns, you get all the camos, you get all the pro perks, you get everything that is um, there to be had um, if you were completely leveling up and buying everything. Um, so, you know what, I decided to run Scavenger. I've never tried it before. Um, I figured, you know, I'm going to be kicking some serious butts here. So I'm going to need my, uh, my ammo. Um, and, um, what's, what I actually like about this Scavenger, um, is, uh, I can run around. I don't have to worry about picking up another gun. And, um, I've never tried it before. And I, you know, if anything with the PSN being down, it's opened me up to Scavenger. And um, and really enjoying a gold gun, so I, I, I'm not sure if I'm still going to prestige to the point to go try to get a gold gun. I think you got to go like 14 times or something. I don't know. Um, but uh, scavenger is definitely cool. I'm going to give it a shot next time. Uh, well, whatever time the PSN actually comes back in, so I can play some real games. Um, but here, I was just having a good time. I set up the Blackbird. I got the Chopper Gunner. I got the the uh, enemy uh, Hine. Or what am I saying? Enemy hind. The, uh, the hind. It's going to be a friendly hind. Um, so just kind of playing around. Just, uh, you know, just doing whatever I can do here. Um, but yeah, I mean, th this gameplay, it's not... It, it's it's probably fun and it's good practice if you want to try a new gun. Um, it, you know, if you want to uh, pretend you're a C-Nanners or blame truth for the day and pick off an amazing score that you wouldn't normally get. Um, but other than that, you know, with the PSN being down, I, I, I think I, I enjoy it a little bit more than the single player campaign. That just has me falling asleep. I, I can't even play that anymore. Matter of fact, um, I never even finished up Modern Warfare 2 single player, so I threw that in um, like, I don't know, about a week or so ago. 
And, you know, I played a little bit, and then I tried it the following night and played it a little bit, and I just had it. It, it just wasn't it wasn't doing it for me after playing multiplayer for so long. It's just kind of boring, but uh, this is a lot more fun. We can just pick the computer, the computer enemies off here, and um, it's funny. I put, um, you can actually pick um, how many uh, enemies you want versus guys on your team. I think I put like four to six or something like that. I don't know. Um, I remember playing one on Nuketown where I went like one in nine, and, you know, one myself against nine other players, and I was just going crazy. Um, yeah, you can have, definitely have a good time here. Um, it's definitely something something to do. Um, otherwise, you know, you can bust out the Monopoly or the Parcheesi or the Yahtzee or the Shoots and Ladders or if you got Clue or Candyland. Um, you know, if you don't want to play this combat training, you don't like the single player, you can always go get yourself a board game. But, um, anyway, um, yeah, I was actually looking at some other games tonight over at GameStop, and I'm saying, you know, I'm not going to be digging any games that aren't really, like, a multiplayer game, so since I can't do that right now, um, there's no point of even buying anything, so I'm kind of waiting it out, and, um, it's getting a little out of hand, um, but, you know, what are you going to do? So anyway, I'm just kind of running around here. I'm, I figure, you know what? I put a claymore up here, and uh, I don't think anybody's um, set it off. So I figured, you know what? Let me go back up there and kind of hide down, and I'll go into the uh, the gunship and then the uh, the chopper gun and uh, go crazy here. Um, so I just basically sped this up. But um, I'm not the best with this enemy. Uh, or when my, I don't know why I keep saying enemy, it's always when the enemy brings one of these out, and I'm used to seeing this thing, but um, this um, gunship, I'm not really too used to driving it. It felt like uh, I had no clue what I was doing. I'm much more used to the chopper, chopper gunner, letting somebody fly it for me and just worry about shooting. But uh, this map, if you can set the chopper gunner up or the, um, the gunship, on a, you know, a regular team deathmatch. This is probably one of the best maps um, to get one of these two um, kill streak rewards on. Because there's really there's nowhere to hide. Hope you guys enjoyed that combat training. Remember, don't be hating. That's a 48 to zero. Uh, you like that score, don't you? Um, only in combat training, folks. If you can get that kind of score, uh, normally, then. Uh, you be the man or the girl. Anyway, talk to you guys later. Try another choice.